Hey guys, it's Jules and this is Lupus Diaries. Good morning, friends and family! <laughs> Kamusta kayo? Today, we're gonna be having an update regarding my lupus state, my new doctor, and my shingles pa rin hanggang ngayon. <laughs> If you're following me on Instagram, you'll be much more updated sa mga pangyayari sa buhay ko. So if you haven't yet, go follow me there. I'll put the link in the description. I would also appreciate it so much if you could click the subscribe button below to show your support and click like to help spread lupus awareness. So first, let's talk about my lupus update. Sabi ko in my previous update video that I will be going to the lupus doctor end of June. Pero end of June, hindi pa rin ako pumunta because nagkaroon ako and so I wasn't able to take my laboratory tests. I'll be going this Friday instead. So, ganun pa rin yung medication ko. I'm taking prednisone 10 mg, HCQs, um, mycophenolate mofetil, 5 mg enalapril. We will know sa next checkup if I need to get a kidney biopsy done. Feeling ko, oo, oh, 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 pero we'll see. <laughs> Sana hindi, pero we'll see. And then, I also said na nagkakaroon na ako ng manas sa legs at sa paa. I thought mawawala siya, but hindi. Every week ako nagkakamanas, and I'll explain the reason in a bit. Every week since May 12, I have been going to another doctor in Ongpin, Manila. Di siya yung normal doctor who practices Western medicine we all know. This doctor practices Eastern medicine. So, instead of chemically produced tablets yung pinapainom niya, I drink very, very bitter tea. <laughs> so let me show you some clips on how we make the tea, how it looks like, so you'll have an idea about Eastern medicine and ganja kaiba from the Western ones. So we also bought this tea from a drugstore there in Ongpin. Sasabihin sa ng doctor where to buy. One bag of tea, uh, two times a day mo siya iinumin. One in the morning and one in the night for the same bag of tea. We also bought this teapot there at the drugstore. And the tea needs a specific kind of teapot for it to boil in. And this is the kind of teapot. There are other teapots sa instruction, but this is the one that's available. So this is the one we got. So we boil the tea in, I think, two cups of water. Tapos low and slow dapat yung pag boil sa kanya until mag evaporate to one cup or 1.5 cups and then tsaka mo siya inumin. Trust me when I tell you na sobrang pait niya and other kinds of flavors na minsan nakakasuka. <laughs> Kadiri siya guys. <laughs> Eastern Medicine also sells herbal tablets pero we opted for the tea kasi mas mabilis daw yon gumana. Aside from that, he also gave me a list of food that I can and cannot eat. So, nag-adjust na naman ako ng diet. So, let me know in the comment section below if you want me to make another video on what I eat. Adjusted version. <laughs> Updated version. So, ayun na nga. Every week ako pumupunta sa kanya. Every week namamanas yung legs ko. The problem is... And this is in Manila, and I live in Tagaytay, so that's at least 1.5 hours of travel. Nang nakaupo ako sa car, and then pagdating don, we we have to wait in line, cause ang daming tao, ang dami ng papa check up sa kanya. Sumikat siya ngayon, so lalo na ngayon, sobrang daming tao. So I wait another two hours, two to three hours, bago ako maka pagpa check up for like five minutes or less, <laughs> saglit lang. Because of that, napapagod ako. Kakaupo. Apparently, when you sit too long or stand too long, mamamanas ka. Well, that's in my case. I don't know if applicable siya for everyone who has kidney problems. So, dapat most of the time, nakahiga ako with my legs up above my heart level. Eh, kung ganun naman gagawin ko forever, every day, ano na mangyayari sa buhay ko? Nakahiga na lang ako. 
So just to assist, I have been using these compression socks. Uh, socks siya, pero putol yung dalawa niyan dulo. <laughs> this helps daw kapag may manas ka. So, after ko mag-rest ng nakaganyan, yung legs ko, um, I use this. During din pala. I use this and then if kailangan ko mag-work or gumawa ng other things, I wear this. I think nakakatulong naman siya magpababa ng manas. <laughs> So, bumababa naman yung manas ko whenever I rest up. But, ayoko yung feeling na may sakit ako every week. Hindi siya nakakatuwa. And that's the reason why hindi ko muna isi-share sa inyo kung saan tong new doctor ko. Because, personally, I haven't seen the results yet. But, I will update you as usual kung may proof na nagumagaling ako. Ang mahal niya rin kasi. <laughs> Ang mahal <-mahal> niya. <laughs> Around 500 pesos per consultation every week yon, And then, 2 to 3,000 yung cha ako every week. Plus, yung travel fees pa since nasa Manila siya and ako nasa Tagaytay. So, sakit sa bulsa. Every week kasi niya ina-adjust yung tea, kaya... Every week ka dapat bumalik. Minsan kasi matapang yung tea. Minsan, hindi masyad matapang pero mapait pa rin. Pero matapang pa rin. <laughs> Basta, nag levels of tapang, of intensity, of the herbs he puts in. Ina-adjust niya yun every week. So, every week, iba-iba yung lasa ng tsaa mo. Never ka masasanay sa lasa niya. Kadiri siya every week. Kadiri pa rin kahit weekly ko na siya ginagawa hanggang ngayon. <laughs> so, paano ba niya ina-adjust yung tea? Actually, yung checkup niya is also weird. Uh, hahawakan lang niya yung pulso mo. Dalawang pulso sa magkaibang kamay. And then, he checks my tongue up and down the tongue. And then, he asked me kung anong naramdaman ko during that week. And then he adjusts based on what you tell him and yung kung ano narinig niya sa pulso mo. So as of today, hindi pa ako natutuwa sa kanya. <laughs> um, gusto ko lang kayo i-update sa happenings behind the scenes. Yun yung reason why... Hindi ako nakakapag-upload ng video every week kasi nagkakasakit ako. Okay, moving on to the last update, yung walang kamatayang shingles. <laughs> Until now, nakakaramdam pa rin ako ng phantom pains and itches. Actually, lalo siyang lumalala ngayon. Ito itsura niya today, July 4, 2023. Three and a half months since the start of my shingles. The other night, I had to drink Lorata din sa sobrang kate, hindi ako makatulog. I also stopped the topical medication that my derma gave me. Immunosuppressant din kasi yun, so medyo ayoko na, ayoko na ng gamot. <laughs> Tama na. <laughs> Nakakalmot ko siya sa gabi do, kaya dumudugo na naman siya. So basically, hindi ako masaya the past month. With regards to my lupus. <laughs> Marami nagka-comment and nagma-message sa akin. Sabi, nakaka-inspired daw ako. But I have bad days too. Pare-pareho lang tayong lupus warriors. May panggamot man or wala. We feel pains and hardships. Kahit new or old lupus warriors, we are all still learning to adjust. We're all just fighting and figuring things out as we go. Anyway, thank you all so much for listening to my rant. <laughs> Medyo naging rant yung update video na to. I'm still so so thankful for everyone who cares about me and who cheers me on, especially my family. I love you all. Let's keep on fighting and don't forget to love ourselves. Bye!